Also, resources. I need to put the sawmill back in and the stone quarry. Where is that enemy gonna attack now? From this side. Awesome. So they'll finally go through the wolves. <laughs> um, I'm not getting any stone right now, but that's fine. I'm gonna get a few more archers, maybe. Just a couple more. Um, these archers have they leveled up? So each unit can level up a little bit, which will increase the stats by a tiny amount. Not like a tremendous amount, but it makes a difference in the end. So if you have 10 units that are level 2, they could destroy like 15 units that are level 1. Just an example. Sawmill assign workers to the sawmill real quick. How's my food doing? 30. I can assign one more person to the farm at some point. How many residents do I have? Um, some are being. Uh, born right now. I guess they are born. I don't know what they are. <laughs> they just like res not really resurrected because they haven't died, have they? <laughs> I don't know what the term would be. Just spawn, I guess. Yeah, they just spawn. <laughs> Get a few more archers, and all of my military guys have spawned in. Great. And I'm gonna work on another trebuchet once I get one more stone. There we go. And I'm also gonna build a tower. It will be a wooden one for now because I don't have enough stone to build a stone one but I can also always upgrade that later down the line and I'll put it over here could have probably plucked it down there but it's fine Sunstone Workshop is doing fine my Sunstone is really through the roof right now well not through the roof but it's really good it's really really good um, what can I use my wood for right this second I can possibly build a fence for now and build another tower over here because the time will come when I want the enemy to like like walk through a tunnel I guess you can say I'm also gonna build another wall over here so the enemy will just walk through this tunnel and I have trebuchets everywhere and the same thing over here which is the nice thing about this I'm kind of like a choke point they can only really approach me from one angle technically even though it's like north and south but to get over here, they have to go through just one side, which is very nice. <laughs> uh, sunstone still going up, food is still relatively going up. Hmm, what can I upgrade? I can upgrade this hunter's hut. Yeah, I'll do that. Assign one more guy over here. Um, the trebuchet is not. Oh no, the trebuchet. Yeah, trebuchet has installed because no one was assigned to the siege workshop. God damn it. That's fine now. Uh, so this is being. This is finished building, great, great. Um, I will need to build another house. I should start start upgrading the houses with stone, but my stone um, is coming very pretty slowly at the moment. I can probably put a house over here and squeeze another one over here later on down the line. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that just yet. I don't need another house just yet. Also, I will need to build another tavern at some point. To increase the mood as my mood is on plus two and that's gonna go to the minus in just a moment <laughs> hmm what else has the siege tower finished yeah well trebuchet yeah it's done all right assign a trebuchet over here i can upgrade you later on i have three minutes left oh yeah something i haven't mentioned is this um series is probably gonna be split into numerous episodes <laughs> um, this might be episode number two who knows and yeah, I want to try to make it a goal to survive to day 10. If I survive day 10, and because it's currently unlimited, I just wanted to see how far I can get with it on the hardest difficulty. And to get through the hardest difficulty, I had to really work hard on getting a good, good seed, good world to be generated. And I think this one is pretty done good. Oh, I can actually make another trebuchet right now, which is nice. Which should finish in the next two minutes. It will finish in the next two minutes. So actually get another trebuchet over here so I have three trebuchets which is gonna be really really good and the enemy is gonna be walking past the wolf territory which is fantastic because they'll get slowed down a little bit and if they clutter up by the wolves maybe the trebuchet will reach them and actually do a lot of splash damage to them so hoping for that as well to happen um, should I get a stone quarry over here as well I was like, why can't I build it? I don't have it captured. I need 400 to capture this. 
Actually, no, I'm not gonna capture it in case the blue torches switch sides. Because when you capture a territory, ter ter yeah, when you capture a territory, sometimes the blue torches can switch locations, and I don't want them to switch. Right, assign a trebuchet over here. One of the twenty. Yeah, my my guys are looking really nice. There's only like twenty. Let's see, yeah, five archers. So there are. 24 people over here. Yeah, 24 swords. I could have just double clicked and checked, but you know, I like to do math sometimes. <laughs> oh, for some for some reason, the Sunstone Quarry didn't have um, free workers assigned to it. It's weird. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I don't want to capture that just yet. Uh, what's the next thing? A tavern. I should build another tavern. And a builder's guild at some point. Um, tavern, tavern. Let's see. Like I mentioned before, I don't want to be destroying any trees. Can I just like build over here? Just build a tavern next to the church, you know? <laughs> Even the priest needs to drink every now and then. So after that, I'm gonna actually. Yeah, next turn, I'm gonna capture this territory. Um, so I can get more stone quicker. And. Well, once I get my forts out, and once I have more stone, I will get more trebuchets. Well, most of I need stone for, like a lot of things, really. Um, yeah. All right, let's see. So the enemy's coming from this angle right now. I can see four trolls. Let's see a little bit of a zoom on them. Oh, like the sounds of trees going down. Oh, pretty loud. Ah. <laughs> A few more trolls over here as well. So five trolls in total. Yeah, those those wolves are just not gonna stand a chance. But at least they're like slowing them down a little bit, you know. And I, I have three trebuchets over here, and one of them might go down. I am pretty sure it will go down, but I might not if I get these guys in position quick enough. So I will actually get these swordsmen into the fight straight away. Oh no, oh, oh, more things have spawned. Oh no. Ah dear. Alright, so these trebuchets are going for them as well. Okay, awesome. Yeah, the trebuchets are doing a lot of work. But here come the trolls! Still a bit of a zoom on this fight. This is so awesome. <laughs> I think a few of my swordsmen might die over here because the trolls do splash damage. Oh, they're trying to get this battering ram in position for this wooden tower. I lost one guy so far. That's no biggie. Yeah, I think we're, I think we're good. Yeah, those siege towers are the most important thing, I think. <laughs> if I didn't have those siege towers, then I would have been in a world of pain. Lost three people so far. So what I will do next turn, I will get another trebuchet and then a ballista. So actually, I will put a ballista over here. What ballistas are really good at are destroying um, trolls effectively. They do a lot, a lot of damage. Oh, wolves. Wolves, why are you attacking me? Why are you, why are you angry? Don't be angry. So actually, I have not lost anything this time. Great. And I will capture this. I will... Get a stone quarry over here to get more stone, like I mentioned before. Upgrade this, assign a worker. Actually, no, I need. I'm gonna upgrade a couple of houses. That's what I'm gonna do. So, since I upgraded these two houses by one, that will give me plus two um, residents. How's my food doing? Hmm, food might be going down in just a second, some 10 right now. Hmm. A lot of hmm going on right now. <laughs> what what is my next step? Probably capturing this field. What's what's the enemy coming from next? From the south. Okay, so the wolves are not gonna be used, so I can actually capture this in just a moment. Oh I already have it captured, never mind. Um field. Yeah. Get a field and then get a windmill as well. Because why not? Windmills are good. Windmills are just increased, um, used to increase the uh, the speed in which you create food in this area. So I finished the stone quarry. I can't assign anyone to it right now because a lot of buildings are being built. <laughs> a 
that's fine. Do I need stone for anything right this second? No. Oh, yeah. These guys are... I should assign some people to the tavern because my, f my mood is a minus right now. Which is no bueno. Oh, that's why I needed stone to create another trebuchet and a blue star. That's right. <laughs> so I'll try to work on that. Uh, food is in a minus right now, but that's fine. Assign one more guy to the tavern to increase the speed in which the residents are being constructed. And I'll actually build a few more houses. So one more house over here. Let's see, where else? Hmm. I want it to look pretty. I don't want to just like randomly place them houses. Maybe one over here. Like a cheeky little house in this area. There we go. Hmm. Alright, so I'm gonna wait for stone to gather a little bit more. Also, there's a guy that's AFK right now, so I'm gonna assign you to the stone quarry. There we go. That's a little bit laggy, but got, got there in the end. So, a trebuchet. Also, I put a tower over here and one more over here, so that will be for the trebuchet and the boost. Also, I like how the terrain changed a little bit, so that's a little bit curvy on this side because I put a tower over here. So it's nice a little attention to detail like this, which is why I'm enjoying this game quite a bit. They're coming from the south. Maybe it would be a better idea to put a trebuchet over here. I might do that. So I'll have these towers, but... Or maybe a trebuchet over here. Hmm. Both would be valid options. Oh, why is there only two people on this hunter's hut? Residents are still being made. That's fine. But now I'm getting 40 stone a minute rather than 20. So that could be fantastic for increasing all the houses' population eventually. Yeah, I'm trying to get myself comfortable. Like, this is day five. Day five, and. We have five more days to go, and the enemy is only going to get stronger each day. This is like this is not my first time playing on the hardest difficulty, but this is um, probably the furthest I got so far. <laughs> oh, why were the people stuck in the tower? That was weird. This is finished. Now my blister is being built next. So yeah, since I'm being attacked from the south, I will probably just focus the defenses on the south a little bit. So I'll put a trebuchet on this side. And then I will put a ballista once that's done over here. So the ballista has a lot more range, but it's more single target focused. So I have a lot of guys that are just not doing anything right now, which is actually what I want it. So I can assign them to all of these places. So there's no more being built right now. So I just have one more worker remaining over here. That should be fine. So your stone is being gathered pretty quickly. Hmm, should I upgrade this one? I should. And I'll assign one more worker over here. Actually, before I... Nah, that's fine, that's fine. And I'll upgrade the house so I can get another worker so I can have a builder on standby at all times. Um, I do have a few arches over here. I might just pluck them down somewhere. Hmm. Where should I put the arches? Maybe just behind the wall. I think they'll be safe over here. And I'll get these soldiers right here. And I'll leave maybe two or three or five <laughs> at the back just in case the enemy manages to push through and I have to like um, maneuver the enemy with the soldiers around the towers just get two guys over here that should do one more guy one more guy there we go <laughs> I'm sure this will be enough sunstone is still decent my food is up my happiness is Okay, that will need to improve as well eventually. Um, what was my next step? What is the next step? Ballista should have finished by now. Yep, so I assign a ballista over here. And maybe I build a fence. Yeah, I'll actually build a fence over here. So the enemy, if they if they like come from this angle, they have to go around. Or they might just destroy the wall, but you know. They might have to. They might just go around because you know, it's an AI, and the AI on games like this not always the most clever. So they might just like be a little bit dummy. <laughs> I can upgrade a few of these houses now. 
Also upgrade the tavern to add another worker over here eventually. Also the nice thing about each turn is that you get more time to work on your army and just work on your thing in general. Also I can probably work on one more trebuchet right now. It's not going to finish in time, I doubt it will, but if it does, it finish in the next 30 seconds. I don't think it will. It does, it does not say how long it takes for a trebuchet to finish, but I think it's a little bit more than 30 seconds. I'm going to time it. <laughs> If it finishes in the next few seconds, that means it's like 40-ish seconds, but yeah, it's not looking like it will. 10, yeah, don't think it will happen. But, I think my defenses are good for this turn as well, and we will see what the enemy is going to bring to us this time around. Let's take a look. Alright, so, ooh, oh, a lot of people. Okay, this spawned a lot closer to my castle than I thought it would, but that's fine. That's the way you want to play. That's the way you want to play, isn't it? Okay, that's a... Hmm. That's an admirable force. Alright, guys. Are you going to attack? Yeah, there we go. Archers should... Yeah, archers are doing their work thing as well. Oh, it's spawning even more. Oh, they spawn knights as well. And more trolls. Ooh. Ee. Ooh, wee. Okay. Uh, where is this archer going? Uh, focus. Focus, guys. Have not lost a single unit just yet. So it's looking good so far. The battering ram is being demolished. So that's good. I'm gonna fold these guys back a little bit. So that this treble shake can start shooting too. There we go. I have lost one soldier so far. A worthy sacrifice. Where's the burst focusing? Oh the burst are oh, this thing is being and getting in the way. This, this, yeah, this tower is getting in the way. There we go. Now it's shooting someone else. My, now this tower is getting in the way. God damn it. <laughs> Should be fine though. The trebuchets are doing the thing as well. Lost four people. Why are these guys not attacking? Attack! There we go. Like, I had to force them to do the thing. That's fine though. Alright. Just gonna rush the catapult with the few remaining soldiers. What are you guys doing? Oh, this guy's just having a time of his life. Look at him. Just swinging his sword and these guys are running in one spot. Hmm. Have you guys glitched or something? So the enemy's coming from the same angle again. So that's fine. And this trebuchet just finished. Hmm. Oh, this guy's level is going up. What the hell? What the hell is going on over here? Look at him! His level is going up. He's just... I think he's just like thinking. Maybe he's like dream fighting. He's getting levels from his dreams. Oh, my resources are maxed. Okay, um, let's upgrade this real quick so I can grab a little bit of wood. Alright, since I have so much wood... Um, what do I do with all this wood? Okay, uh, resources. No, military. I'm going to build a couple of fences over here real quick and then a couple of towers for when the enemy decides to come from this angle there we go more towers is always very nice then a tower over here I just wanted to get rid of all this wood that I wasn't spending um, happiness is on zero and I don't have any workers right now other than a couple of people building this thing over here but that's fine that is fine sawmill stone quarry yeah I, I can upgrade a few more houses actually get a few more residents going real quick yeah upgrade all of these I can upgrade them all one more time as well later on which is why I wanted to get more stones I can do just that how's my sunstone oh my sunstone's on the minus okay that is not something we want to see. And this guy is just still glitched. That's weird. He might have to die, maybe. Maybe what I will do, I will get all of these guys behind. Like like, like this, and let these guys die or something, so they can respawn, because I think they glitched. Hmm. Yeah, this is weird. Look at this guy's stats. It's like 340 thing HP now 
This guy's like got like a hundred less, so yeah, it's he's he's improving quite a lot. And one more tower is gonna be built. All right, so these towers are finished, and let's see. Don't really need to assign anyone to the church. Who do I need to assign the person to? This Sonson workshop. There we go. Because I'm on the minus right now, and if I remain on the minus, I can't build more siege. I might capture this real quick. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll just start getting more sunstone from this side. Um, where else do I get sunstone from after that? There's more over here. Oh, and more over here. And there's a farm area I can capture on this side. Hmm, let's see. Maybe I'll work on getting a ballista on this side. And then maybe a ballista over here. Yeah, so I'll have a ballista on that angle, so they will shoot down like this, kind of like a arrow formation, formation in a way. <laughs> I think this is fine the way it is, so I'll probably have a ballista over here and two more trebuchets. And a ballista, ballista, there we go. I have a lot of stone, alright, let's, oh my happiness is not happy, oh god. Assign a guy to the tavern. <laughs> um, also, another thing I can do, I can put some decorations around the map, which is something I've not been doing. I can put like a fountain. I'll put a fountain maybe here, maybe. I can build a statue. Where would guys like to see a statue? I'll pluck it down where this tree is. There we go. So the tree won't get in the way of the view of the statue. <laughs> um, a bush, a bush. Get a few bushes over here. I don't know if that's what people want to see in their next to a house, but <laughs> they'll have a bush now. Let's see if I can make it look pretty. Just focus on the decoration for a little bit, you know, just relax for a little bit. And I really like to zoom in on this every now and then just to see how pretty everything looks. There we go. Yeah, look at that. It's coming along. This town is really coming along. I'm really loving the way it looks. Also, I don't need to build any walls around the back over here. Because it doesn't seem like the enemy is bringing any siege equipment. Which is weird. And this guy is level 10 now. He has... Um, 400 and something health. And 76 attack, so... Yeah. Um, how much does a knight have in terms of attack? 60, so he is more than a knight drive. He is a paladin, basically. And I have a lot of people, actually, so I will assign people to the market. And they will all be able to sell something. <laughs> there we go. And now I have no more workers, but that's fine. Oh, look at that happiness. It's on plus 12 now. There we go. That's what we wanted to see. Oh, I'm getting 500. Oh, look at the amount of resources we have. Oh, night's coming and my wood is maxed out. All right. So they're coming from the south. Oh, I didn't assign the ballista, did I? Or was I making one? I'm not sure. Hmm. More catapults, more of everything. Yeah, so the ballista's going to do work. The trebuchets are going to do work. And there's four trebuchets right now, so... Oh no, they're gonna destroy my sunstone workshop. No! That's fine. And I hope that these guys will start getting attacked. They are. Okay, good. Like, I shouldn't be saying good, but. At least the trap. Oh, this is actually really good. I can use them as bait. <laughs> oh no, no, you guys, don't, you guys don't attack. Nah, you guys don't need to attack. Nah, just let them. Let them do the thing. This is like the first time I actually want the enemy to kill my troops. And once this guy perishes, I will... And he'll be resurrected, so that's fine. And he will no longer be glitched, so he'll actually be able to be used in actual combat. <laughs> oh, they're trying to destroy my tower. Oh, that is a lot of enemies. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Alright, that guy has perished, and so has a troll. Go on, archers. 
Do your thing. Yeah, I definitely need to have a ballista over here. Wow. Come on, fight! Wow, look at the trouble she's doing work. Also, there's no friendly fire. I'm not sure if you've noticed that, but my units are not being destroyed by the enemy fire. <laughs> and I haven't really lost anything this time.